Hey guys, welcome back to a vlog. Long time no see, but today I wanted to start vlogging more on a good schedule. So I have with me all these white pieces of paper. As you guys see, this is January, which I don't know why I wrote January because February is coming up in like two days. So um, I'm gonna have to make a new calendar for that one. Yeah, I don't know why the hell I just did that. But with me, I know I haven't talked to you guys about this little boy right here. Oh, he's getting up. He likes getting up on his chair. And looking outside the window yeah boy you comfy um yeah i am fostering this dog right here his name is arrow but um i decided to name him mako for the time being because arrow was just like a temporary name that they gave him at the shelter um, i'm sheltering sheltering i'm fostering him which is why i've been so busy and i have not been uploading videos which honestly is kind of an excuse I'm gonna go walk him and after I'm gonna go buy a lot of stuff that I have been needing to buy. I have this really bad habit of waiting till everything runs out at the same exact time to then buy it and then I feel really bad that I spent so much money because I waited to buy everything at once. So I'm gonna take you guys with me to Target, Ulta, Trader Joe's and um, it's gonna be a really simple day. He is so weird. This is such a small chair that he uses to look outside the window, but instead of his little bed that I gave him or that the shelter gave me for now, he decides to um, try to fit in this little chair. You're something else. You are something else, boy. Like, he's a really big dog. Why are you in this little chair? But you know, whatever floats your boat, buddy. Whatever floats your boat. Oh, look how much it starts snowing. I swear it started snowing five minutes ago and it's already sticking. Looking for some ink for my printer. I really gotta find something and I need to print things ASAP. Yeah, that's right, folks. We live in life. <gasps> Look how cute this one is. It's only 15. If it's 15, I'm thinking about getting it. Oh, 25. 25. What do you use this for? What? What do you use this for? Putting stuff on it. Storage basket? Wall shelf? Put it on a wall. <laughs> This is the thing you use to, um, the garlic smasher. Oh, hi. Hi hey guys, good morning. Today, what day is it? February 1st. January was such a long month, but it's finally February 1st. Um, I'm getting ready. I mean, I just got ready and I feel like this looks kind of like a spring look. I'll show you guys later. Um, right now, I'm gonna pack some stuff that I gotta ship out. Never really told you guys, but I have an Etsy shop if you guys wanna see it. I'll link it down below. I sell balloons, so because Valentine's Day is coming up, it'd really be really cute because they're rose gold and they're confetti and they're like the really big ones. If you guys want, check it out. It'll be linked down below if you guys don't want. You guys don't have to, but um, I have a few orders to ship out. I ordered these on Amazon. I'll also leave them down, link down below because it's a really good price. This one brings 25 bags and eight, it's 8.5 times 11 inches. So if you guys need to ship out stuff, I recommend using this one because it was really good reviews for the price. Plus when I went to Staples, I bought the same measurement one. I think it was 8.5 times 12 or something, but it was $14 for like 12 bags. So I was losing um, money technically and this was nine. None, none for 25 bags. Oh, no, it was 12 for 25 bags, so it's like half the price. Um, yeah, I'm gonna pack these up. I'll show you guys real quick how the balloons look. Oops, I just dropped it. I'll show you guys real quick how the balloons look. This is how the balloons look. Um, yeah, they're rose gold, six of them, and then 10 of them are the actual confetti ones. Um, as you guys can see, the confetti on inside of it is also really big, so when you blow it up. It's filled with big confetti, which is really cool. And yeah, I'm gonna pack this up, take another one out, and send them today. Oh, oh, 
son. You, mister. Oh, come here, come here. Look at me, look at me. Look at me. There you go. What do you want? I have no food on me. I have no food. <laughs> He's such a fat ass. Listen to me. Look at me. Look at me. Good boy. Good boy. You need a shower today because you are smelly and you look dirty too. Okay? Okay? <laughs> Yo, he also licks so much. If you leave your hand up. I'll show you guys for some demonstration. He will lick you for like 50 seconds. Please don't embarrass me and do it because I'll look bad if I say something and you don't do it. Let me show you guys. This is my new bed frame. I got it from Ikea. My bed is decorated really, really simply. And I just have these two pillows. I also use that one right there, but I kind of like how it looks kind of a creamish, just all kind of bright. Um, but let me show you how weird this looks. So I didn't buy a box, a spring box. So this is my mattress here. My mattress kept sinking because this bed frame back down here only has a bar here and then on the ends. So technically... Almost the whole bed sinks down except for this middle part. So I put this other smaller mattress under that I don't use. And then because this was sinking, I put all these boxes to try to hold it up. Uh, yeah. As you guys can see, I need to invest in a spring box. It's been holding up, but then I don't really know how the stuff under my bed is doing. And that's how my bed is. You guys know I've been trying to decorate for the longest time, but you know, one step at a time. First, the bed frame. I'm not even gonna mention the painting because who knows when that's gonna happen. Good morning. Come here. Say good morning. Good morning. Uh, I'm gonna put a clip real quick of what I did yesterday because I just filmed a short clip of when we went to play football because yesterday was such great weather. It was like 50 something, which is really concerning for February. And yeah, it's very concerning. But also yesterday, I went to Ulta. And I was looking for a concealer. I was really looking for that e.l.f. concealer, but I think they're only selling it online, which is really sad because I really, really wanted it. Um, but I also went and bought two mascaras, a lip gloss, and eyebrow pencil, which I have been missing. So, let me show you guys real quick. I picked up the Lash Paradise. It's my favorite mascara ever. I never buy high-end mascaras because I feel like they all look the same on my lashes. Um... So, this is a really good one. They didn't have the blackest black or something like that. So, I just got the Mystique Black. I'm going to see if I see any difference and let you guys know. I also picked up the ColourPop Boss, Brow Boss eyebrow pencil. Because um, when my sister and I filmed the makeup swap, um, I actually left my mascara and my eyebrow pencil in her makeup kit. So I had to purchase it now. And then because I didn't find my lip, I mean my concealer, I bought a little lip gloss from e.l.f. So I just did my makeup. I don't know if I'm getting washed out right now, but I actually just did my makeup a little bit. I did my eyeshadow, my concealer, powder. But I left to do these on camera so I can show you guys. I have a little mirror here. And I'm gonna... Oh, don't you guys love when you open and you mascara and makes that noise? So let's see. The one thing that I find that I don't like about this mascara is that when you first, first get it and you put it on your lashes, you have to comb through it a lot to make it look thick. If not, it just gives you length and that's it. So I know for the first few times, that's what's going to happen. It's just going to look very long, but I like it to look a little thick too. Like a little volume would be nice. Um, I also got the ColourPop. Please. Okay. Oh. 
Nih itu nih. 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 Bye. Bye. Nggak boleh lah. Stay. Yeah. I have to hold. Mako in because every single time there's someone at the door or trying to leave, he always tries to leave too. Uh, yeah, so back to where the hell did I just put it? Oh, they didn't have dark brown, so I got the brunette one, which should be fine because my hair looks a little bit like a lighter brown lately. So I'm gonna. He always cries when somebody leaves. This makes my brows look a bit more natural. Let me just finish this. I just finished doing the rest. Use my glow kit from Anastasia in that glow and use Dripping in Gold. Um, and then just for a little bit of warmth and blush, just use my e.l.f. contour powder. This bronzer is on, honestly one of the best drugstore ones. Even if you don't like this really um, intense pink, even though it doesn't look that pink on in person, it's actually a really good good deal for just a bronzer um so now i'm gonna do the elf gloss i just lined my lips with the essence lip liner in ddaeb the bay oh no it's 11 in the nude <laughs> what the hell is that um and this is a really good peachy nude if you guys are looking for it really really creamy and affordable of course because it's essence so now the lip gloss that i got from elf is a lip plumping lip gloss and it was only five bucks so i'm going to open it up Ooh, i really like how this is clear this lip gloss is in champagne glam i'm always attracted to the same kind of glosses i swear i should have gotten something that's a little bit different maybe more yellow or pink but i'm gonna apply this now first impression of this gloss that's how it looks like um it is it does feel like a little thick when you're putting it on your lips um i haven't found any plumping effects yet but i literally just put it on but when it is on it doesn't feel goopy it is a bit thicker than my other glosses like the ColourPop one um but still for five bucks it's a really nice gloss it makes me look a little juicy and it blends in really nice to this lip liner because i literally just lined my lips i didn't fill it in um yeah i like it actually i just it's kind of hard to get out of here, but the Dofa applicator is really nice too. So that was my little haul and try on real quick. Every single time I buy something or feel like, even if it's just a few products, I will show you guys. I think this is a better look at my makeup. It's always really fresh and glowy. My lips actually do feel like they're tingling right now, so that must be the plumping effect. But yeah, this is how the eyebrows look, how the mascara is working. How it looks and my lips and i think Don't. so i'm actually gonna end the vlog right here i'm gonna start the next vlog right now and i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog i know it's more of a homey type of vlog but i had a lot to show you guys and i hope you guys enjoyed that don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like it as well if you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in the next either video sit down video or vlog okay bye see you bye bye